After Jay Happ and Dustin Antolin pitched four innings, Joe got two innings himself. A couple of innings, nothing across, and a strikeout. While we were away, that is the home plate umpire, Marty Foster, after the foul ball, he's been attended to by the two trainers. Yeah, both trainers out to check with Marty Foster, and obviously the two ball clubs are responsible for the well being of the umpires as they don't have their own trainer, obviously. So both George Poulos and the Rays trainer are out to check with Marty Foster. And I'm sure they're examining him for the possibility of a concussion after a foul tip. He took this shot right at the edge of the mass. You can see how that rocked him pretty good. He got hit earlier in the chest as well on a similar foul ball. And the umpires now wearing that chest protector underneath their shirt. Years ago, umpires had that big balloon protector, and it was a much more protective device. Yeah, it wasn't so good looking, but man, it really protected you. You could get behind the whole balloon umpire chest protector. And the only thing that was exposed was your face. Yeah. And you had the face mask. Yeah, it had a little cut out for your chin. And you mm -hmm. put it right up against your chin, and it was a big inflatable chest protector. And I don't know if they're going to let Marty Foster continue. I think they're going to try to figure out how they can make this happen as Marty is looking at the lineup card, and the crew chief is Mike Winters, but. I'm sure this is more in the hands of the two trainers about whether or not Marty Foster should continue, but it looks like he's going to stay in the game. Obviously, the concussion protocol is very important to players and to umpires.